Boys of Juice crew, how are y'all doing on this Tuesday afternoon? It is August the 23rd, and I am um, out of my hotel. I'm out and about. I'm going to um, Maple Street Cafe or something like that. It's over on this other side by me. Y'all can't really see. But, um... Yeah. Whatever. But anyways. Um... Yeah. Let me get out of here. Girl, don't say nothing about this house. Jesus. Push, push that back in there. <laughs> Pat that back together. Yeah, whatever. Um... Got on all my purple today. <laughs> Since, you know, I got them purple Crocs, I, I'm bringing out all my purples. All my purple out. All my purple pieces is coming out. <laughs> Okay, I got the chicken club. I got this, but I only got half of it. So you know how the waffles come for? I only got the two. So I got that, and then I got just some potatoes and a drink. Food is here. Ready to go. I have to. I have to. Uh, sit on my teeth. Hopefully, it doesn't fall. <clears throat> it's to throw our stuff away. Let me show you. Dirty dishes. Okay. Trash all of this. Trash, trash. Civil. <coughs> and 
Hey there. Oh, my bad. And so that's all you do. Okay, this is a little nice area. Probably expensive as shit, too. So, the thing is, now that I find where I want to stay at, which is Gainesville, Florida, um, you know, I've been telling everybody, I stayed in, I didn't stay in Gainesville. I stayed in a town down the ways from Gainesville. But, you know, Gainesville is the city, so everybody comes here to, you know, all that good stuff. So, <clears throat> so now that I'm here, the plan is I need to find a realtor. Um, I think I'm going to do this next week because this week is almost over with. Today is Tuesday, today is Tuesday right? Yeah. Uh, if I don't start Monday, then I just start for the next week or whatever. So, the, um... So today is Tuesday. This week is pretty much, like I say, it's almost over for me. Um, and then, you know, I still want to go to a couple of other places. Uh, like I say, Palm Coast and all that stuff. Stay there for a couple of days. Um, I may go to Orlando and stay there for a couple of days. I don't know yet. But, so, anyways. Um, so now, yeah, I'm going to find a realtor. Because going on like apartments.com or anything like that, they're not really showing you the places here for residents. They're mostly showing you like college stuff, um, you know, um, apartments for college kids and all that stuff like that since this is a college town. Um, <clears throat> so, so anyways, so this, 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 why don't I start talking in the parking spot? It's just instead of parking on the side of the road. Ooh. Woo. Let's try that again. <laughs> Let's try that again, but over on this side. Okay. Because I'm talking to y'all, and I'm not paying no attention to where I'm at. And I was all on the curb, y'all. So, let me go back here. <laughs> let me go over here and talk to y'all right quick because I'm, I'm, I'm doing other shit. Okay. I'm not paying attention to shit. So, Anyways, so like I was saying, um, yeah, they going online looking for a place. It is on they only showing college stuff, college rooms, college houses, college, um, anything, and yeah. So I'm gonna go look for a realtor, um, and then also I'm gonna go to like a staffing company, like a. <clears throat> The last place I went to was called Manpower. It's like a staffing, you know, like a um, a staffing company. You y'all know what staffing companies are? Like, I want to say not a travel agency, but you know, um, a job placement type of place. So you go there, you figure out um, what your skills are, or something like that. They give you like a couple of tests, tests or whatever to, to find where your skills are in. Or something like that. That's the last. The last time I went there, damn, I'm not even parked in a parking spot good enough. The last time I, the last time I went there, um, I got hired on at uh, United, and that was, you know, they was trying to see how how fast I type and stuff like that. So, yeah. So I'm gonna do that when I come, you know, next week. I'm gonna do all of that. So fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Uh, I get something. Um, I'm very positive that I, I will get something, especially a job. I'm really good at getting a job, especially like cashiering or some, some shit like that. Something simple to start off. And then as I build, you know, through time, I can get, you know, something better. Not really, because I'm not really looking for a job job like that. I'm just looking to establish myself so I can get my own place. Um, even, you know, I do have somewhat of a job, but people don't, or businesses don't look at that as a, as a job because they think, oh, um, like one of your people or whatever, what if they don't pay, then you won't have money to pay them. All that stuff like that is like, 
<clears throat> act like I don't have money saved up, but that's neither here nor there. So, anyways, so yeah, that's it. I'm excited, y'all. That's why I'm talking so fast, and that's why I'm talking so fast and talking so loud because I am very excited that I found. I kind of not that I knew it was gonna be Gainesville. I knew it was gonna be some part of Florida. Like I said, I just didn't know what part of Florida I wanted to be in. Because there's a lot of nice places in Florida. It's not just this area, Central Florida. You know, a lot of places in Florida are very nice to stay in. So, it, it wasn't like, <clears throat> whatever. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm excited. Now, like I say, it's 12, 16. I think I'm going to head out to the Palm Coast area. I'm going to text Miss... I was about to say that name. <laughs> I'm gonna text her to see what's going on. I'm gonna just be like, I'm gonna come out there, but I'm just gonna come out there just to see how it is. Not really, you know. I ain't gonna call, I ain't gonna text them out there. I'm just gonna go out there and be like, oh, I came out there. <laughs> if you didn't see me, you'll see me another time. But um, yeah, y'all, I'm excited. Let me head up to Palaka right quick. Let me get my shit together with these people. And, um... Yeah. I'm excited. I'm in my old stumpy ground. I didn't tell y'all, listen. <clears throat> now, I ducked myself off in a hotel, like, way back in the back, like, in the trees. I'm by the freeway and all this stuff like that because I know my friends, people, you know, are pretty out here in Gainesville and I really didn't want to run into anybody just yet like I didn't want to run into uh her family his family he's my friend too but anyway that's neither here nor there uh I didn't want to run into their family so I tried to you know stay far away right I called myself because I didn't know Sam's carry cold water in bulk that's what I wanted y'all know I normally go to Dollar General and get like six bottles of water at a time and that's like um, depending on the bottles of water I get, that's between nine and ten dollars. And then at Sam's, you get a six pack for ten dollars or seven dollars. You get a whole 15 pack for 13 bucks. So instead of getting six waters for ten dollars, I'm getting 15 waters for 13 dollars. That just sounds like a better deal for me. Anyways, so <laughs> I went to Sam's not thinking I'm going to run into none of their family. I get my water. I get my little, I got, I got these here. <clears throat> oh, shit. <gasps> this is my laptop and shit. Oh, God, God, that's so heavy. Got that. I got my core water. I bought these things here. Right, because I need some some something sweet, but not something sweet. So girl, how you open this thing? Oh <laughs> and it was easy. So I got these and then I got some chips and I was like, you know, I go to when I go to Sam's I try to I get they I go to the little food court thing and I got me a pizza and some frozen yogurt. That's it. That's all I want to get from from Sam's. So I'm standing in line, do 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 do, minding my business. Look up to my side. That a cousin is. Shit. Now I could have been rude and act like I didn't see her, but she was literally right there, and I'm sure she seen me as she was walking up because um, I got this big juicy side on, juicy tattoo on my back, and. You know, I'm I'm not ashamed of my but not that I had on anything, you know, weird, but I had on bike shorts and a regular, you know, muscle shirt type of thing. I mean, you know, I can get I I can be spotted. <laughs> so I'm thinking she probably already seen me anyways, and I was like, fuck. I could have been ruining me like and just wait till she left. Well I was like, um, <clears throat> excuse me, ma'am. She works at the Sam's, and I was like, hey, girl, what's up? She was like, oh, Juicy. Mm -hmm. 
only one person knows I'm actually here in this area. <laughs> only one other person knows I'm here. I texted him, I told him, I was like, damn, your cousin just seen me. And he had just warned me about, you know, that's her, that's where she that's where she be at. I didn't know she I thought he was talking about just in that area. I didn't know exactly Sam's. But he was like, um, when I first when I first told him where I was at, he was like, Oh, you better watch out for the, the person. Ask the actual person. And I was like, Oh yeah, I'm gonna make sure I'm hurry up, get my water and hurry up and get back to my apartment because I was thinking I would see this person or just the you know, the family out out in the streets, not really in the hotel. So yeah, I ran into one of his cousins and I was like, I'm not here. You didn't see me. She was like, okay, <laughs> give me your number. I was like, shit. I told him that. He was like, well, we'll see how long. <laughs> we'll see how long that lasts because I'm guessing she doesn't hold ice. She can't hold ice water. So we're going to see how long this lasts, see how long they they know I'm here. I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to, you know, finagle myself and act like, you know, I'm in Orlando or I'm in some other part of Florida. I just, I told her I came out here just to check out my store. You know, she asked some stuff. And, you know, I was like, oh, I just came out here to check my storage and all that stuff like that. <laughs> She's like, oh, you here to stay now or not? I was like, I don't know. <laughs> so I made it um, back to my hotel, I guess you could say. Um, I was at this hotel already. I didn't record anything because I have so many clips, y'all, that I have to edit right now and add more to it. No. <laughs> so some stuff y'all are seeing, it's like I want to show y'all everything, but I can't show you everything I'm doing, like every bitty piece of my life. I'm trying to show y'all and I can't do that. But, um, so, um, I was already in this hotel, but I was upstairs, the exact same room. Well, I, it was a two bed, two queen bed. This is a king bed. I was in 415, I'm in 315 now, is what I'm saying. <clears throat> um, just coming from Walmart, I got me a little bit of like they uh that turkey cheddar sandwich. I got me some juice because I felt like some juice instead of just drinking water. And yeah, that's it. Um what I was about to say. Yeah, I've been I've been horrible at rec at uh, recording. Or just bring y'all with me. Because like I said, I have a lot of clips that I need to get through now. And I'm finally going to do this try on haul. Because I need to do this try on haul. Because I want to wear some of these clothes like now. So, yeah. Anyways, this is what I had on. The reason why I don't wear light colored shirts i can wear white black blue like dark colors kind of that's not gonna show sweat but yeah i can tell the concept without without the sweat try to look past the sweat hold on let me turn on this light and back up some because this mirror is kind of positioned in a good way that you can see the front and the back at the same time Cause you can always see the water stain. See, sweat stain. Yeah, this is my purple bodysuit I got from all oh, that sweat. I don't know if y'all can see it. It's sweat over here somewhere, but that's why I don't wear light colored stuff because just shows all the sweat. But yeah, this bodysuit is from Tori, of course. These little shorts are from Walmart and my, oh, you can't see them, purple Crocs. Oh, <laughs> little baby leg didn't do nothing. 
purple Crocs. Y'all, I need to get another pair. I need to get the light pair because I am in, well, I'm just happy I got them in purple. That's all I'm saying. Because if I had the light purple, I could have matched them with this. But they didn't have them in my size, so I would have got them. Because it was buy two, get two free. But it was like selective ones. So I just got these because I ain't never had Crocs and I wanted Crocs. Period. Um, but yeah. Also, what I got from Walmart. Look how cute this little bag is. It's Heather Purple. It's from Reebok. I know y'all seen this. If y'all been to Walmart. Look how cute. I said I needed, I wanted another purse. When I was in Roses. Did I take y'all with me to Roses? I think I did. But I ain't take y'all in there. I took y'all just with me. Um, yeah, I was looking for another purple purse because the purse I have not is nice but I need some more room but I also want it little but I don't know how, how I'm gonna wear this because it's not long enough for me to be uh I don't know I don't know if it's long enough for me to be a cross body bag but it could be I guess this is where my other bag sits. Well, no, this one's just really long. Let's see. That doesn't look, I don't know. I don't know. Or my other one. Well, I, I like my other one anyways, but I just need more room. More room. This gives me more room. Hopefully with a little wear, like the straps or whatever will, you know, um, loosen up. But yeah, I got this. This was $24, this Reebok. Rebook. It's on the inside. What is it called? It's called a Victoria mini duffel bag. And I don't know if it tells you what the color purple, <laughs> the color purple it is. But I think when it was ringing up, it said Heather purple, yeah. Heather purple. And I'm in some M&M's. Mm -hmm. <laughs> After I just showed y'all those little wafer cookies turkey sandwich y'all know and then these little juices again they only eat 10 calories all that other stuff oh well no sodium is 15 percent they got magnesium and zinc but it's good i don't know 98 cents i don't know cheap ain't always good but Shoot, the ice is only 99 cents, a dollar. So, whatever. Two cents a difference. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna take these Crocs off now. I'm not about to do anything. Sterilize, I mean, uh, <laughs> not sterilize, but you know, disinfect my area. Cause it's about to rain and um oh i think i can even leave my curtains open no i don't i try to leave my curtains open because no one can see me you can't see it's like trees and the freeway and if people on okay hey what is up juice crew how are y'all doing on this tuesday not tuesday wednesday <coughs> afternoon Turn this TV down. I'm watching Doom. Doom. I don't know. Why are y'all still looking at my chesticles? Okay, let's bring y'all up then. How about that? 
And then I'll pull this back down, something like that. Oh shit. Okay. Hey, what is up, Juice Crew? So today, well, right now I am in the process of about to do this try on haul, but I want to come and show y'all this new wig I bought. I was trying to find a U part wig instead of um a wig wig but i seen this at the beauty supply store and i thought it was cute look how cute and it's a detachable um a detachable bang oh and it's synthetic i don't know the name of this thing she took the she took the bottom part off so I'm not sure what the name of this is. Did my TV go out? Oh. <clears throat> but anyway, this is all, this is what it is. It's a headband wig. Um, you know, just something for right now until I can, I don't know, do something to my hair. And again, I left all my wigs. Where did I leave them in? Mississippi this time, not in Dallas. Oh, it comes with a little a chin thing? Girl, I don't know how to do this. Okay, let's take this part out. Let's move y'all back some. Now that I got y'all up a little bit. Um, yeah, it's like maybe one. I just got through eating some KFC. I wanted to try that uh, <clears throat> macaroni bowl. I think I'm just gonna stick to the to the regular one, cause technically I'm not supposed to be, you know, eating dairy like that since I am a little lactose intolerant, <laughs> right? And then it has this little this little chin strap. Y'all know what this is. Y'all who, uh, women who wear wigs, I don't know what's up. And then, oh, okay, the bang is underneath all of that. Oh, and then here's where you can, detach. The bang, not the banging. Okay, stop. <laughs> um, <clears throat> okay, my head is a little bit big, a little bit. It's just oddly shaped. Whatever. And uh, I just got a little stocking cap on. I went to, the fuck? How do I put this thing on? Do I put this behind my head? Take my glasses off too. Me acting like I don't know how to put a wig, a wig on. Okay, was it supposed to be behind my head? I didn't try it on, so me and you are gonna fit. I, are gonna see how this look on me. <coughs> I don't even know. I can't see nothing, y'all. So don't. Are you laughing with me or laughing at me? <laughs> this feels like this is not gonna look right. I mean. If I kind of ow, oh. it will comb things. Let's sit you back some, like here, not all on my forehead, but mm, you can see no hair. <laughs> okay, hold on. 
with the does the picture show her showing all her hair? <clears throat> no, it doesn't. That's what the bang is there for. Mm -mm. Okay, let's try with the bang. I think you can kind of put the bang anywhere because it just sticks on stuff. <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. Give me a minute. <laughs> It's a little tight on my head. Okay. Um, whatever. And it's supposed to come, oh, not supposed to. And then it came with another headband. Man, this is already too much on my head. And so I put this on there. How do y'all do this? Like, how, how, how? How? Shit. Okay, let's do it like this. Let's pull this up. Okay, I don't even think I need the combs because they're not doing much for me but hurt my damn head. Okay, let's find the headband part. Listen, this is just doing too much for me. Listen. This can go. It's cute once I figure it, you know. I, I don't know. I have to figure some stuff out, but this bang can go for now. Okay, so yeah. Hey, what is up, Juice Crew? <laughs> How are y'all doing on this? This is Thursday, Wednesday. I don't know, the 25th. Yeah, the 25th. Right. So, what are doing? <laughs> I mean, Dax, we at the moment. I'm laughing at myself. Because I got so nervous, y'all. So, listen. So, now I know I wanna, where I want to be. Um, I'm starting to make some steps and, you know, trying to find me a place and all that stuff like that. And <clears throat> the lady called me. I got so nervous, y'all. Like I was in a, like I was taking a quiz or something. And it's just, Lord, I was just talking to myself like, dang, why'd you get so nervous so fast? Uh, anyway, she didn't only ask me, all she asked me was, um, how much I make, what I, not what, I, yeah, how much I make, have I been doing since I was self-employed, have I been doing it longer than two years, and, you know, just some basic questions, pretty much. I got to explain to myself and all that stuff, I'm like, girl, what is going on? She ain't asked you none of that shit. Why are you talking about all that? Look <sighs> at the rambling on at the mouth. But anyway, y'all. I am um, sitting outside this Lowe's in Palaco. Because I was going to go to my storage. I called them people. I looked at the video that I had. I don't know if it's good enough for them to really see like what was messed up or something like that. So, I'm gonna go and take some pictures. And um, I came out here to do that. End up going to Zaxby's and give me a big 
Zack Snack. Because I'm hungry. And, uh, yeah. And then she called me. I had, it came from my bank, right? Because I was wondering why I was getting charged a fee. <clears throat> Cause you ain't supposed to, you ain't supposed to charge me for my for holding my own money, right? So I went to go close my account and do all that stuff like that. Come to find out, it's me that's causing the fees because of the transferring I'm doing and stuff like that. Long story short, it's me that's doing it. And um, I was like, oh okay. Again, we just got to talking about a whole bunch of stuff. And then, yeah. She helped me out a lot with a lot of stuff that, that, um, that I needed to know and stuff like that. Anyways, um, so. That's how we're here at this moment. So, anyways, I went to Dollar Tree because I needed to get some gloves. Because if I'm gonna go in there and take pictures and stuff like that, I just got some <coughs> gloves and stuff. Now I'm not touching no poo poo or pee pee or nothing with my mask in there. I got this um this um y'all yeah, know what it is. I got this because I do, I think I need to clean my brushes on my brushes. So I got that from the dollar 29, the dollar 25 store, as well as this little bat. This bat and ball. Um, so that I can boot, punt, not punt, boot. Um, no, that's right, punt. No, that's kicking, girl. I'm thinking bunt. <laughs> um, or sending them across the way. The rats that's in my um storage unit, you know, bop them on the head a little bit if they come a little close, you know, smack some stuff around so they know I mean what I mean, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> They're right gonna see that shit, grab that shit, and throw it. It's for my safety. So I got that. And hopefully I can take some pictures or whatever. I think I'm about to uh, text my friend's mom and see what she's doing out there in the Palm Coast area and, and go out that way. Um, yeah. Today is Thursday, right? Gotta be Thursday. We'll see, because I really don't want to go mess with no rats right now. Tell you the truth. Y'all, I got so much stuff to do. <clears throat> I got so much stuff to do. Now now that I know where I'm going to be at, you know, now I got to start doing all this stuff. It's like, I got to get a storage unit to put this stuff up, because I don't, you know, I don't have a place to stay. So, put this stuff up. Didn't get the stuff out this other storage unit. So I have to get all this done actually next week because the storage unit. Um damn, do I feel like I don't feel like messing with rats right now. I can tell you that much. Right now, I don't. Cause I have to pay for September, you know. No, I have to pay for the 28th this month. Yeah, I have to go deal with the rats, y'all. So, anyways. <clears throat> trying to lock my shit. So, anyways. I am... Uh, yeah, so I'm going to text her and see what she's, what's going on in Palm Coast. And maybe go out there for a couple of days. And... 
No, I think Daytona is next to it. So I actually probably go there for a day if that and then go to Daytona since they're excuse me, right next to each other. It's all the same, so it really don't matter. I can say either way. Anyway. So yeah. Um but I was saying I'm gonna have to get a a P.O. box. To have my mail come here now. Lord, I have a lot, man. I just thought about all the shit I have to do. But I am here. Um, the only people who know I'm here, like, <clears throat> in the this area is my friend and his cousin. Two people. And that's one too many. <laughs> Shit, that's one too many. <clears throat> but hopefully she forgets that I'm out here and don't tell anybody, but whatever. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm still out here by myself in a sense um but i'm not but i am okay y'all let me go to this damn storage unit. i just thought about it because i can't i have to uh because i'm not i'm not trying to pay i'm not gonna pay for that shit no more then you want me to then you're open it i'm not paying for that shit <clears throat> you can throw all that shit away i i don't know i don't know Oh, I just don't want to deal with it right now, y'all. Fuck that shit. But I did talk to them. Um, I spoke, like I said, I put the claims in already. She said it'll take, they want it all to get done in 14 days or before 14 days or 14 days is the limit or whatever. I don't know. So hopefully I'll get the email. I'll send them a little bit of the thing, a little bit of the video. <clears throat> that I did and then if that's not good enough I'll go back and take some pictures of it and uh, they want me to tell them how much you know stuff costs off the bat $600 is my bed so off the bat that's that's what I'm getting um, and then everything else if they didn't get into my toad if they didn't I don't know if do they chew through totes I think I asked y'all that too do they chew through totes or get in, I don't know. We'll see. That's why. That's why I want to go in there and see if they got to my totes. Cause I had stuff in there I want. I had shoes still I wanted to wear, and I had clothes still that I wanted to wear. <laughs> or at least sell. If they up, if you know, uh, Lord, please don't let the man fucked up my shit. But everything else in there, all the little little stuff, I say maybe. Eight hundred to a thousand dollars. My shit is up to two thousand. So I, I should say I don't care how much was how what I lost or whatever. I don't care what it was that I lost, how little bit of it that I lost it or whatever. Um, I still lost it, and my and my whatever is at two thousand dollars. So you should just be giving me two thousand dollars. Period. Hmm. That's what I should say. But anyways, um. We'll see. So, let me text Miss and see what she's doing. All right, y'all. I'm done eating, and I'm tired of these people looking at me. I'm really not tired of them looking at me. I don't give a shit. But uh, I don't need nobody to call no laws on me. Because we ain't in the, in the best of one of those, you know, in the best of states that. Anyways, bye, y'all. Look <laughs> how close I am to the beach, y'all. All this little sand. And look how close I am to the beach. Okay, so I'm in Flagler's, Flagler's Beach, I think. Oh yeah, they gonna have to fix this. I mean, I hope I can get back up here. 
The sand don't seem too bad. It seems like it can hold me. Woo! Just crew. So I made it to my room. I'm still in Palm Coast. Where y'all seen me was on the beach of Palm, Palm Coast, like Flagler Beach. It's pretty much all the same. Palm Coast, Flagler Beach, uh, Daytona, uh, St. Augustine, all the same. They're right on the coast. So that's where I was. Just catching up with old times with my friend. And <laughs> my friend's mom. I guess I can say it like that. Cause, anyways, whatever. So, I'm in this Red Roof Plus. I've never been in Red Roof Plus. I've only been in Red Roof. Just regular Red Roofs. But this is actually a nice little Red Roof uh, room. I got a little double, double beds. They gave me a little heart. Oh, hold on. I'm trying to move this cord out of the way. I put a little heart on my bed. <clears throat> I got two beds. Um, regular AC thing, window. It's a little tight, but how they got things at, it's like it just kind of, you know, all goes together. You know what I'm trying to say? It does feel, you know, it it may look tight, but it feels big. And then I like this little round curve thing right here. And if y'all guess what that is, then it's correct. <laughs> then you have your little sink and stuff. Me here. Um, bathroom. I really don't like glass showers, right? Because their glass showers sometimes are so tight. You know, my hips can't fit in there like that. They're those little rectangle things. But this shower here is round. <laughs> so if it's my booty, I'll bring it out so y'all can see. So it's round. So my booty can be here and the rest of me can be there. Ain't that so nice? They thought about me in this shower. So this. And then. Yeah, y'all seen that? And then I got a mirror here, and then that's the door. Look at my purple Crocs, hey! <laughs> so I didn't bring barely anything in here uh, because I am only spending the, spending the night and I came in late. Well, I did my uh, reservation at around three something because I figured I, I'm not gonna drive back. It's already three something and I'm out here. So driving back to Gainesville or wherever, trying to get a hotel, I might as well just find one here. So I found one here and then I just bought some clothes. Um, I started my dang cycle, ain't that some shit? But I'm happy I did. I'm gonna tell y'all something about that. But I just bought some clothes. I bought my little cover. Since they have these nice pillows that says, firm and soft on it I'm gonna use all four of the firms or at least two of them firm and soft and firm and firm and soft and firm and I like that they have two different floors like they have this floor here and then they got carpet here like I like carpet for you know I like carpet but then I don't like carpet that gets stained and all that stuff like that. So I like that they have two different floors. If I get my hotel like I want, that's how I'm, I'm going to do it. I would like to have carpet by the bed. 
so that when you walk out you got that nice cozy carpet under your feet and then you get to this cold stuff that'll shock you up you know what i'm saying anyways that's neither here nor there so um yeah that's it that's all i got it for the day tomorrow she's supposed to be going out there to go get do something for them or whatever and i'm just gonna go back to gainesville and no well, i'm not gonna go to gainesville first i'm gonna go to palaka to try to see if i can get some pictures took in for um you know for my storage if i need to do some more i think i'm just gonna do some anyways just for my benefit too and to show y'all how bad them damn gone rodents rodents how bad they did my stuff so i'm about to disinfect here and eat my wendy's i'm mad that they gave me this instead of a chocolate frosty they didn't have no frosty but whatever okay so yeah i'm gonna eat my little five for my five dollar my five dollar biggie bag disinfect try to edit something at least get something started um but um uh, we'll see that's probably not gonna happen i'm probably gonna start that i don't know tomorrow maybe we'll see i ain't making no promises but all right y'all i will see talk to y'all Okay, y'all, so I'm at my storage unit, right? Um, can y'all see this one here? Not this one, this one. Um, I got my bat. <laughs> my little, what's the name? Um, let me get these gloves. I don't know why I tried to reach that way. Mm. Okay, so where did that bag go? Oh no. This is trash. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't be wearing a dress at this moment. Oh. But I wasn't thinking, y'all. I was just thinking put clothes on. So, we're going to see what we can do. Move some stuff around. Pray not to get bit by nothing. Um, where's my alcohol? Let me spray that on my body. So, just in case something wants to try to bite on me. They're going to be tasting alcohol. Okay. Let's do this first. Uh, since I got a dress on, I got to put it all the way up, like my, on my thighs and shit, too. Turn this AC off right quick. When I get out, I put more on the back of my legs and on my feet. Ugh. Alcohol. Put these little raggedy ass gloves on. They look like they about to break. <laughs> I don't know if I'm allergic to latex, but I never get latex gloves. And then these got, they got powder in it. Whatever. I just don't want you know something going up my going up my on my hands, but going up my arms actually. 
or sweating. Okay, that's what I'm talking about, y'all. <laughs> sweating through my, uh, in these gloves here. So that's why I got these gloves on. Because I don't like how that, I don't like the feeling of, you know, how these, how these gloves feel when you sweat in them. <laughs> Oh. All right. Let's turn y'all some more to see if y'all can see some stuff. Oh, y'all can't even see my unit. It's actually right there. <laughs> I'm gonna try to turn y'all as much, but y'all gonna be getting this part here. Where's my keys first? Listen, get y'all asses on. Is it about to rain? I'm trying to make some excuse. Oh, y'all ain't gonna see shit if I close my door. Uh, but I actually do need my <laughs> phone to take pictures. I don't even know why I attempted to even do that shit. I don't have on no proper clothes. I'm on my cycle. But to pay this unit. Um to keep it until I get, you know, whatever I'm supposed to get from it. Damn, my glasses are dirt fudging tea. Let me clean a little bit of it off of something. I tried to go through it. I mean, I've seen some stuff, but unless I have another, another um, storage unit, unless I can get another storage unit, to put the stuff that I already have in here in there and then I can possibly do something but I need to find a storage unit I need to find a storage unit I need to get a P.O. box I need um, to do a lot of shit the, the, the hard the easy part was finding not really it wasn't easy none of this was easy <laughs> finding somewhere to stop, finding somewhere to stay and now that you found somewhere to stay now you have to do the stuff <laughs> so it's, it's not it's not over yet the journey has just begun <laughs> uh, 
but uh, now I guess I'm just go ahead into Gainesville, right? Um, head into Gainesville. I guess I'll just get go to the post office that's off of 34th. Cause that's like the big, the big one. And um, yeah, go from there. Get get a post. I'm trying to find a storage unit that has. You know how um some they have some storage units that are like for college kids where they only need you know space to put maybe you know a couple of totes or something like that and then they're just coming back to school the next you know next semester that's what i'm trying to find i'm gonna keep this like this um this out oh, this out trash so that's what I'm. That's what I'm trying to find. I'm trying to find one of those those type of uh, storage units where I can just put in. I have what I got: my shoes, um, my clothes, and you know, just some stuff that I can take out. But then I can also put. Um, shit, I, I'm not trying to spend. I'm not trying to spend a lot on the storage unit to only have for you know maybe not even a month or just pay one month's worth you know what I'm saying because I'm gonna go to Mississippi also while I'm in the process of doing that you know the process of doing all the other stuff that I'm doing I'm gonna go to Mississippi to get my other shit and bring that from down here so the only storage I have will be Dallas and here until uh, oh, my lips look so bad. I need to stop putting this shit on y'all. Y'all gotta remind me. Because I'm a smoker and I always think I don't need to be putting lip gloss on because I'm about to smoke and I don't want all that on my joint. So, but I look so much better when I have, you know, moisture to my lips. Anyway. So, um, so, uh, yeah, so I'm about to head into Gainesville. That's going to be another 30, 40 some odd minute drive. I, need to, I was trying to look for a storage unit, but all the storage units they have were like five by fives. I don't, I don't need that. I don't need that much um, stuff. Truck of the truck comes barreling down the road. Um, yeah, that's it. That's my storage. Listen. So to avoid, to avoid <coughs> to avoid from paying this month's rent at that storage unit, I need to get another storage unit in Gainesville. Get a PO box because I need my mail to start coming to me because um, the lady was talking about. I need to look through my emails too. Uh, that that you know when they award me my, you know, from damages to my uh, thing, they'll have to mail a check out to somewhere. So, um, where are they gonna mail it to? I gave them, I gave them my brother's address because my mail is already getting forwarded to them. So, but I'm gonna forward it to the P.O. Box in Gainesville. So that's what we're doing. We're going into Gainesville. Do that. Hopefully, I can um, find a storage unit. That's the only problem because I don't need a five by five. That that's the smallest one they got. I don't need that. I need something smaller. Post office, because possibly I can go another way into Gainesville from this area. 
instead of going down them long ass roads. And I ain't roll up nothing, so I can't really smoke while I'm going down these long ass roads. I should have turned right there. But I'm going to turn right here. Mm -hmm. Key, so you don't want to access to it. You're going to line up this little divot here with the clear slot here. That's how you unlock it, unlock it, the lock. You to make sure it's flat, then it's flat side up. Just like that, you'll turn it, it'll let it go whenever it's locked. If I can go down the stairs, that will be even better. Y'all know how you be around a person who is not into their job or whatever, or they have like an attitude. It's like, news, I'm coming here to patronize your building. I'm coming to pay to be here. And the attitude you give, boy, I'm ready to go. Let me take, pay my little money, get my little keys. How the fuck do I get out of here? Cause I don't even want to be around them. You can take that negative energy somewhere the fuck else. How the fuck I get out of here? The fuck? Take all that negative energy. I didn't even say shit. He had an attitude even before. Who does he have attitude with? I don't know and I don't give a fuck. But guess what? <laughs> I ain't gotta deal with your ass. Let me take my shit. Let me get my shit. Let me get the fuck up out of here. Girl, I ain't never been around the most rudest motherfucker ever. Again, if you don't like your job, find another one. If you don't want to be on a Sunday, you should have booked <laughs> another time to come. The fuck, I don't even know how to get out this bitch, but I'd rather go down the stairs than to be around that motherfucker. Period. How the fuck I get out here? Shit. I don't need to sign shit else. I don't need to do shit else. Girl, I'll walk outside. How'd I get out this bitch? The storage quest off of Archer. Listen, if I didn't need a storage, bitch, if I didn't need a storage, motherfucker, I want to came, but I need a storage. You know what I'm saying? I do. I need to get this storage and I need to um, move, you know, move my other shit. Um, you know, I need a storage, right? 
sorry, <laughs> music was playing, y'all. Threw me off for a minute. And <clears throat> if I didn't need one, I'm only gonna have it for a couple of months. Sixty-nine dollars, or it was fifty-four with insurance. All that bullshit they have you doing or whatever but big ass dude nigga i don't want you it's always those type of dudes who think because he looks good that somebody else thinks he looks good i don't want you don't even look at you i don't even understand that type of shit it's like god damn bitch what the fuck is you doing with your no driving ass this bitch uh damn near uh clip my fucking car because she don't know how to fucking drive what the fuck is going on here look at this shit Look at this shit. This bitch almost hit my car. Cause she ain't she can't drive. Get it right, bitch. I don't understand people who get big ass trucks and don't know how to drive that shit. I'm so pissed, y'all. I'm so pissed. Anyways. So yeah, I go in there. You know, I'm nice and all this shit. He, I don't even know why he's pissed off. Maybe he pissed off because he had to answer questions or whatever because he got to work on Sundays. Who gives a fuck why? But he had already had an attitude. I was just sitting there waiting uh, because the sign said, you know, the door was locked. He was probably out there showing whatever. So I get back or he gets back. He opens the door. I said, oh, thank you. Uh, he didn't say shit. Okay. Well, what's your attitude for? It ain't got shit to do with me. The whole time, just throwing attitude, just throwing attitude. Like I said, you better be lucky I need this fucking, uh, that I need this fucking thing. Cause I ain't no fucking way, bitch. Negro. My own people. But you already, you already know, when they're around a whole bunch of white folks, they think they better than other black folks. So, what the fuck ever. But I'm make sure I'm gonna call the, I'm gonna call tomorrow. I'm gonna come up here tomorrow and get a better understanding of what was going on because this bitch here that bitch there that bitch ass nigga there God couldn't even I didn't even say shit he's so dry in his uh, uh, this is here this is there uh, I ain't even stop, stop listening to his ass. I was on Instagram and looking at TikTok and all this shit while he's talking. I already know. I've been in storage units before. Just tell, I asked him, I said, you ain't got to show me. Just tell me where my unit is. I'll do it. Well, I got to show you how to put the lock in. I'm thinking, how hard is it to put a fucking lock in? Stick the thing in there, click it. There, you got it. I ain't paying no attention to him. You do this. You have to line this part up with it. And you have to do this and you only have three keys uh we don't have a master so you're the only one with the that's how fucking dry he was i was like i don't even just stop talking after he was done showing and he locked the thing up he walked one way i walked the fucking other way he went to the elevators i went to the stairs bitch i go down the stairs to not be around your stupid ass like, hey just girl so i've been in the, i've been back in the room i ate Watch TV. You know. Now I need to do some other stuff. But I was uh, going through my, not going through my purse, but just putting my stuff together. Not whatever. Um, putting a lock on my keys and realizing my keys, all these keys, go to some sort of storage unit box or something i got a p.o box yesterday friday yeah i got a p.o box friday i think sit y'all up here okay maybe yeah so i went and got a p.o box yesterday so I got P.O. box keys the storage unit I just went in today 
um, the storage unit in Dallas, <laughs> the storage unit in Palaka, and then this is the security box that's inside my storage in Palaka. All these keys. Yeah. <laughs> But no, I was going to see about my, going to see what I had to use to get into the storage, like the cold, because um, I couldn't even, I couldn't even be around that person no more. Like, I would rather, I would rather, what's his name? Sure. I would rather go down two flights of stairs, out a, a door that got, that, locked behind me prayed that somebody came through the gate so that i can get out i'd rather do all of that than to be in your presence one more minute that's how that's how funky his attitude was and it was like for what reason why why but i don't even care i'm gonna go back by tomorrow because you know that's what i wanted to do today was get a storage unit and then um, you know, do some stuff in here. But yeah, I'm gonna go tomorrow, put some, put the stuff I have in my car in there, so then I can get the stuff out of the other storage, the stuff that I want out in, um, I didn't put it and bring it to that storage. Then I'm gonna go back to Mississippi get the stuff out that storage while I can because the first is coming up uh, it's what Thursday or Friday one of those and I'll be paying $90 I'm not paying $90 for that storage in Mississippi I might as well just go down there take a day go down there well two days or whatever because I'm not doing the turnaround even though it's like six hours but I'm not gonna do that so um go down there get myself, spend a night, get up the next morning, and then come back and then put that stuff in my storage. And you know, continue to look and do what I've been doing before, you know. Um, yeah. So, that's what's going on. Oh, why well, my stomach growled? I just ate, um, so yeah, I got a P.O. box, I got a storage unit, another storage unit, so, so far I have four storage units that is going to turn down into two here, oops, here in Dallas, and then sooner or later, Dallas is going to be cut out because I'm going to have to go way out there to get that shit. Y'all imagine if I toted all my stuff out there. I'm glad I only had, anyways, this like triple, triple d dipple shit that didn't need to go, whatever. So, that's the, that's, that's the headache that's going on now. I knew it was going to happen because, you know, everything, <sighs> anyways, I'm not going to let this person's negative energy continue to lay on me because it ain't in me. It's just, you know, right here. But yeah, so I'm not doing much. <laughs> About to edit. I'm gonna get myself, I'm gonna do it at three o'clock. It's two ten right now. Um Yeah. Oh Lord, I want to show y'all that I I listen. They call it in blah. They call influencers influencers for a reason. So, I'm going to show y'all two of the things I've seen uh, an influencer sh on here on YouTube. I'm going to put his name up. I'm going to start saying people's names now. Like I said, I'm going to start um, shouting out people that I watch and who I got put on, with put on. But anyway, so, he he got put on through somebody else. I don't know who he was talking, who, who he, whatever. So, he showed the two items that he got. And I'm going to show you the same two items that he got. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah. But they had other other flavors of this drink. 
that he picked up. But I got the exact same one that he got. Because who knows if the other ones don't taste like this one. But I'll show y'all that um, a little bit later. And then, it, then that barbecue. Let me show y'all now. Hold on. My damn computer bag. My damn computer bag tried to kill me. Anyways, okay. So, they said something about this. Smokehouse, burnt ends, dipping sauce. At first, when I tasted it, it's really sweet. Like, you get the brown sugar, but then after a while, I guess if you stir it up good enough that you'll get all the flavors in it but the first thing i tasted was sweet it's like i don't like sweet stuff like that or sweet dips and stuff like that so it didn't until i started eating it more and clearly i like it i tried the other the chicken salad one but it was nasty to me so i didn't even say nothing about it and then he had this exact same thing flavor and all Um, I don't even know what this is. Oh, it's a probiotic plant fiber, vegan, polio. Is that polio? I don't know what this is. But I seen him. He picked it up. Somebody else he said somebody else said something about it too. And I was like, okay. Uh, I haven't tried it. Take no, it's our take on classic cream soda blend with real strawberry juice, vanilla bean, and a dash of lemon to create a modern as okay. Let's try it then. Let's try it since I, I'm talking about it. So I got I'm at this little angle. But I didn't feel like I don't have my tripod in here. And then that light behind me, that window will be bright in y'all face. And mm. smell like strawberries. It's not bad. It tastes like a, a watered down cream soda. Like, you know how cream soda got that, you know, that creamy kind of thing to it. You can taste it. It kind of got that creaminess to it, but it's really watered down. It's all right. I don't know what it's for. Well, it's a probiotic, so it helps with the digestion. Am I supposed to drink this before or after I eat? I'm looking for directions. <laughs> like it's going to say, drink this 30 minutes before. All right, I'll sip on that for the remainder of the day and let y'all know how that goes. I had on my dress today. My, um, hold on, because I don't want to flash out because it's, it's short, but it's short when I move, so. <laughs> you know how it just kind of rise up on the booty? So I had on this dress. Don't mind that I did just eat. So it was a little sucked in. But anyway, just need to hear another. Had this on. Hopefully y'all seen that. Yeah. It's short, but you know, whatever. It ain't that short. I knew I was coming. I was coming to and from. 
from the hotel room to the storage unit, from the storage unit, back to the hotel. That's it. Ooh. Oh, excuse me. But anyways, y'all, that's it. That's all I'm doing. That's what I've been doing. Room looks. Uh, it's not bad. Did I show y'all same room? Oh, it's not bad. It's pretty much the same. Same room. Like the last one, but. I don't know. It's like the first one. The first one was a double bed. Yeah, and I was on the fourth floor. Second time I was on the third floor. Anyways, y'all give a shit. <laughs> All right, y'all. I'll talk to y'all later.